Good morning, student. How are you? I hope you all are fine. Okay. So today I'm going to teach you the measurement. Okay. So let's begin the chapter. What is measurement? Can you tell me what is measurement? Measurement is the method of measuring anything. The particular method by which we measure anything that is known as a measurement. Okay. So let's begin. See what here. Measurement play a very important role in our life. Okay. Without measurement, we won't be able to measure or predict what is the mass of this particular object, what is the length, what is the area. Like uh, uh, suppose when you go to the tailor and they take the measurement of your body part so that they can make a cloth which fit to your body. And if he is not taking the measurement of uh, correct measurement of your body, then you won't be able to, um, to stitch the cloth which is uh, fitting to your body. You Either he is going to make the cloth too tight for your body or too loose for your body, okay? And uh, when your parents is about to buy some area, they also take a proper precaution so that they are going to measure the area very carefully and then they are buying that particular land. And uh, whenever you are uh, uh, going to a market, when you buy something like veggies, uh, fruits, rice and all, then also you take a proper precaution that they are using the proper balance beam so that there won't be any kind of dishonesty with you. So you come to know that, okay, this is the correct amount which I have to get it, okay? So that is only written out here. See, measurement play an important role in our everyday life. A good measurement is essential for every action we perform. Uh, just now I have told you that uh, measurement is very important in our life and whatever you want to do it. Suppose you are a scientist, someone is scientist out there, okay? And he's performing an experiment in the lab and uh, a specific amount of uh, hydrogen has to be fused with the oxygen so that the uh, water will occur, but will come as a product. But uh, he don't know, he don't have any equipment to measure all this thing. Then what will happen? Of course, there is going to be a disaster in the laboratory, okay? So measurement play a very important role in our life. See, uh, Taylor measure our body part for the better fitting of cloth. If he is not going to do it, then obviously I told you that either the our body uh, dress is going to be too fit for our body or too loose for our body, right? When similarly liquid commodities such as oil, milk, etc. are measured with the standard vessel, the standard vessel. Nowadays they are not using the vessel, but uh, in the earlier day they used to uh, misuse a vessel. No, nowadays also on a petrol pump or somewhere else, you can see that a specific vessel they are using, measuring the quantity of uh, petrol and then giving to the customer. So this is the thing for the liquid quantity, there is a specific vessel in which they measure the liquid and land. When you want to process a land or you want to sell a land, you take a proper measurement of the area of that particular land so that there won't be any dishonesty with anybody, either with you or someone else. Uh, when someone is sick in our house uh, to take the body temperature, we take a, we use a thermometer to measure the body temperature of that person, how much the body has got the heat and these all are known as a measurement early why we need a measurement we need a measurement to measure men area volume or the weight of the solid etc and many more is there liquid volume of the liquid and many more okay see out okay. here the physical quantity referred to the measurement of um, of the mass length area volume of the object. What is physical quantity? Physical, physical quantity refer to the measurement of the mass, length, area, and the volume of the object. We need different instrument. At the same time, we also need a different instrument to measure all these things. By using a physical beam, you cannot measure the uh, area of a land, right? You need different things for that. For measuring meter, or Length, you need different thing to measure area, you need different thing to find the volume of the object, you need different thing for the, you know, the mass of the object, you need a different thing. These are the different objects what we need. We need to to measure the duration of a time, we need a physical balance firm to measure the mass, um, meter, meter day for the 
or measuring of length, area, balance beam to also same. It is also used to volume and as well as mass to measure the volume, mass, everything. Okay. So local measurement system. See, local locally, what we used to do, uh, not not nowadays in our previous in a very earlier phase of life, what was there? Uh, what they used to do, they used to, there was a local uh, local measurement system out there. They, to measure a length or length of a cloth or something, what they used to do, they used to the uh, palm, palm measurement. Either they used this one palm, two, three, or they used to arm length, arm length, this one meter, two meter. And obviously, if they are going to use this kind of measurement system, then it is going to vary from individual to individual. And because of which, uh, it was very uh, creating too much a problem for the, like, uh, okay, fine, you are doing it, this kind of measurement in your locality, but when you go to somewhere out, but this is not going to be same as the person, suppose I'm doing measuring the cloth with my arm, right? And at the same time, some kid, I'm the salesperson in my shop and I'm, I have measured this and have given it and some, for some time I have to go for a walk and my small brother, small sister is out there, obviously as compared to my body mass, body length, the, my brother or my brother's sister's body length, as compared to me, it will be as a, quite a different in size, it might be a smaller, it might be the bigger and he have done the same thing. So again, that particular person who has purchased the cloth from me has come and said that, okay, I don't need this. I know some another colors. And then my brother has measured it and given him. So he start comparing it. And when comparing what he come to know that the cloth which I have given it was the longer in size and the measurement of a cloth which my brother has done that is a smaller in size. So why this has been happened? Because these measurement is vary from individual to individual. And as you find, this is one arm is equal to one meter. Whatever if I want a half meter, whatever if I want a one fourth meter. So in this system, what was problem out there? We are not able to go to the smaller unit of unit of that uh, particular uh, unit, particular system. Like meter is there. I'm giving you the meter, but how are you going to find me that I want in something in centimeter, like a half, one fourth? That, that is going to be a very difficult as for the local system, local measurement system, okay? And that's why by the development of time app, the idea has developed. See, out here is also, this is beta and all something. See, beta. So beta, I think I am, if I'm not mistaken, then beta is something like this, right? Just make me correct if I'm wrong. Just text me or just respond to this video. Okay, I will get you, uh, I will make my myself correct, okay? Though the Bureau of Nepal government studies measurement of mana, see, and let me tell you. So this was happening out there. So the uh, government of Nepal, what they come to know that this is not going to work, right? So they uh, some of the local measurement system they has given the that okay, this is they have given the that particular system to as a national uh, national indication. Like you must have a national animal, national uh, bird, right? At the same way, it okay, this beta okay, I'm giving this beta to the national indication. So this will be valid in all over the country in that particular country. Country, Nepal in Nepal not out of the country okay in Nepal okay but still it was quite difficult to uh, see you cannot live in your home right you need to help you need the help of your neighbor uh, your colleague your friend or uh, your classmate right at the same time you as a country also we need to cooperate collaborate with the other country so at that time this local measurement system or the national measurement system was again creating a problem so what we have done that we have adopted to the uh, national international measurement international standard measuring system okay and we have adopted it and what does that uh, we will come to know about it uh, according to like you see what Nepal government has done that they have given as a particular reason particular uh, local measurement system as a national national indication that is what they says that five pow five pow is equal to one set that is tola when your mother wants to go for the gold shopping they say the one tola two tola like that they say it in the same way five pow in a uh, in a some like uh, you must have uh, heard about it uh, when you go for a vegetable market, one pow, two pow, three pow, three pow, four pow, and four pow is equal to one kg, right? In the same way, of what they are saying in the local people somewhere they consider it that the five pow is equal to one kg or one share or one tola, 
and in some people some locality what they say that the four pow is equal to one sail one dola one kg at that time the kg was not there but you can relate it that is kg only okay and it was also confusing because if in my locality the five five pow is equal to one sale and I'm going to somewhere else, they are just giving me in return of five pow, they are just giving me the four pow. So this is dishonesty, this is injustice for me, right? To come over this, the Nepal government has also understand the importance of the international standard measuring new system and they have adopted. So this is, um, okay, this is the activity. What is this? Uh, this is nothing. You just need to divide your friend group in a group and just you have to measure the length of your, um, what is saying that measurement, the length of your table in your class, chair in your class, or the text in your class with your, and, uh, and your friend will also do it and just uh, identify it. There, there must be the difference between the measurement of your, like you are, while well, you are measuring, you have come with the, that the table length is a five beta and then your friend is measuring, no, this is the 4.5. Someone will come with the, no, this is six. Someone will come with a 6.5. So why this is different? This is different because every individual size, body size is not same. Every individual have their own body size. And because of that, this different has arrived. Okay, understood? Now we come to the standard measurement, okay? This was the activity I have done it. You can do as a fun activity at your home also, this activity. You can measure the door of your house, the bed. You can do it and along with your brother or sister, you can ask him to do it. And when he is doing, you can find the different, okay? This is standard measurement. What is a standard measurement? Why we are considering these as a standard measurement system? See, a standard measurement should indicate the same measurement number all over the place. We use this because that is same all over the world. Okay, that's why we use a standard measurement. For example, if any substance weight kilogram in Nepal Ganj is taken to Kathmandu, it should remain the same there. Whatever has been measured in the Nepal guns, that has to be seen in the Kathmandu also. But uh, previously, what we have come to know that when there's something somewhere, the five power is equal to one say, and somewhere uh, four power is equal to one say, which is not going to be same at every place. But when it comes to the standard measurement, it is going to be same at every place. Okay, it should remain. Uh, it is only possible when the mass used in both place is equal. This is just possible when the mass the particular measuring system which is or the mass like uh, one kg mass we get it on the shopkeeper house shopkeeper right or when you go to the vegetables of the pine you, you see the iron piles of one kg so that has to be same everywhere then only it is possible in another example for international reliability a measurement of 500 meter of cloth measurement at japan should have exactly the same length in Kathmandu or elsewhere for this, the physical quantity of use for measurement all over the world should remain equal. In every measurement of physical quantity, their balance, their basic measurements such as measurement of land, mass, and time are considered. Any other measurement will be a complete combination of any two of them or sometime a combination of all three of them. See, sometimes we can do the length, we are just measuring land, mass, volume, or sometimes we have to measure all these things, okay? So at every place, whether it is in Kathmandu, whether it is in Japan, China, America, India, wherever it is, the measurement has to be same. Then only it will come under the standard measurement, okay? If uh, somewhere it is uh, like I have measured 500 meter, in Japan it is 500 meter, in, in Nepal it is 500 meter, when I come to India it has become 4.5. That, that is not a standard measurement, right? And sometimes there must be a dishonest people who are doing the cheating. So it's uh, exception is everywhere, okay? So next is measurement system and your unit. Measurement system and your unit. There are mainly three system and your unit. How many system is there? Three system. What three system? Three system of measurement. How many system of measurement is there? Three, yes, three. The unit of measurement which is accepted internationally are called the standard unit or the SI unit. The inter, uh, measure unit of the measurement system which has been accepted all over the world, all over the nation, and that is known as the standard unit or the SI unit. 
okay the international system uh, it is it has also got the three unit okay and what are they meter for the length kilogram for the mass and the second for the time and this is known as mks what is it known as mks m meter k kilogram s second okay and this system is used in science laboratory this mks is used in a science laboratory why because this is accepted all over the world like i am doing something chemical some reaction in my laboratory and i am at the same time i am directing my uh, friend colleague in america and uh, then my measurement system and his measurement system is different then there is going to be a disaster right but our measurement system is same then there is a uh, good the good outcome will come but uh, our measurement system is not good then there is going to be a disaster okay and we are going to explore the laboratory which is not good okay being in being in use all over the world it is known as the international system of unit so which system is known as the international system of unit you can say that mks m meter k kilogram s second the second one is cgs what is this cgs centimeter gram second centimeter gram second third is fps foot pound second foot for the length pound for the mass second for the time and this is used in some part of america and the britain and that's why it is also known as the britain system what is it is known as a britain system okay uh, let me stop out here only uh, in our next session when you are done with this video just let me know and you have got everything uh, if you have got everything then i i might uh, second, send you a second video if you respond and uh, unless you just go with the activity you just uh, see it or go through it and uh, make a notes okay write it uh, what is cgs what is mps it stand for what is mkg what is internet listen to my question okay what is in which system is known as the international system what is the standard what is the standard measurement system uh, how many type of standard measurement system is out there and uh, uh, write some example of a local measurement system and the different between i have given you the example right five power four power elaborate it okay write it write the full form of all these things cgs mks uh, epf okay and write it in your note copy click the pic and just send me okay and if in this video you have any doubt just let me know i will clear it okay thank you